Hello and welcome to jasonnewland.com. My name is Jason Newland and this is Stress and Pain Relief Podcast. Please only listen when you can safely close your eyes. Now the idea behind this podcast is to offer you know, different techniques or ideas that you can use to help to reduce either your stress uh, feelings in your body or your chronic pain feelings or both, you know, whichever is the situation for you. The reason I do both at the same time is because the same techniques can be used for both issues. So therefore, that's why I do this in this way. Now, I'm going to go through quite an old technique that I used to use a long time ago. But it is useful and it is beneficial and it works so that's a good thing so I want you to I'm just going to ask you to follow the instructions okay and just follow what I say and do what I tell you to do it's not going to be anything um, particularly complicated uh, but then you can notice for yourself the changes in how you feel. So I guess the first thing to do is to focus on a part of your body that is giving you the physical discomfort, whether that be chronic pain or stress. You can, of course, focus on your mind if it's a stressful uh, if you feel really a lot of stress in your mind, you can focus there as well. So I'd like you to focus on a particular part and kind of give it a measurement between 1 and 10. 10 being the worst it could ever feel and 1 being, you know, non-existent. Basically just there's nothing there anymore. It's changed. You know, as things always change, but this has kind of just changed and gone down, almost like the, the feeling's broken and you, you're you unable to feel it anymore, that, that kind of thing. So just notice where it is now in this moment. Because I'm going to ask you to come back to this, this uh, measurement in you know a few minutes time when we've completed the exercise so then you can uh, see how it's changed you can feel the difference notice the comparisons I guess so to start with I'd like you just to focus on that part of your body I'd like you to almost outline it with a like a marker pen in your mind, just so you can get an idea of the shape. Uh, so give yourself maybe an inch around the problematic part and just draw around it so that, you know, there's no discomfort where you're drawing, but it keeps that part of you safe you know where it is, you know to be careful with it. And once you know to be careful with a part, especially with chronic pain, and you're aware to be careful and to care about that part of you, then the pain doesn't need to be there anymore. It's only there to protect you. Or when you don't need protecting because you're aware of it yourself, 
then you're you're fine. Just in the same way as when you pass your driving test, your driving instructor doesn't continue to drive with you. That's it. That's the last time you see your driving instructor, really, in a professional manner. You don't still drive with you, sit in a passenger seat wherever you go for the next 40 years. It's not needed anymore. Because you passed your test, you've proven that you can look after yourself, and therefore you're free. And that driving instructor no longer worries about you or probably even thinks about you anymore. Which means you can relax yourself without, you know, thinking, looking over to a driving instructor, thinking you might have done something wrong or you're in trouble, but you don't because they're not there anymore. Because you don't need, you don't need it there anymore because it's of no use to you. So, as you focus on that part of your body, the part that's outlined with the marker, maybe the mag the magic marker. So it's just there outlining that area. You can just put a circle around it, or maybe make it you know, very precise and have it almost look like a, a country on a map. And then notice the colour of your skin as it is now. Now what we're going to do, we're going to change the colour within the marker. Okay, we're going to change the colour of your skin within that marker where that part of your body is that you've decided you'd like to have more relaxation in that part you'd like it to feel more comfortable which is why we're here so as you focus on that part First of all, I'd like to ask you to change the colour to red. As bright red as you choose it to be. Maybe you choose it to be blood colour, quite dark red. Maybe you want it to be red that's almost orangey kind of red. It's up to you. And the reason I'm starting with red to start with is because we in our society have been taught quite often that red means danger. Red means stop, you know, with traffic. Red is almost a warning. So I'm going to start with red to start with because we can then let it be gone so any connection that you may have had with that part of your body being maybe in your own mind connected to danger or uh, worry or concern we can now let that go by changing the colour from red to green. Allow that red to just drain away and that green to come up. I quite like the idea maybe green grass, you know, fresh grass. Or maybe a different kind of green. You can choose a green that you like. Just noticing how you feel. 
with that color green. Now you may not like the color green, it might not be one of your favorite colors. It may be your favorite color. But however you feel about the color isn't really important because we're going to change the color again. This time we're going to change it to brown. Change it to brown and you can see the brown color. Whatever brown is to you. There's lots of different uh, types of brown. You could go for type chocolate bar. You could go for coffee brown. You could go for almost just the, you got colors that are almost purpley that are brown. It's just up to you. Have that color there. Notice how it feels. Now changing the color to bright yellow. Bright yellow. Almost like a, a bright summer's morning. Bright yellow. There's a real lightness I find connected to bright yellow. Uh, an uplifting feeling, perhaps. Now changing the color again, this time to orange. almost maybe the like an orange itself that color a real proper orange color just noticing how it feels in that part of your body with that orange color I seem to, for some reason, connect the color orange with vitamin C and the healing power of the sun. So when I think of orange representing a part of the body, it's almost like the vitamin C is just and all the different vitamins and the healing is just entering into your body. Now changing to blue. But pastel blue, nice light blue. Bright and light. And finally, changing the colors around. Start injecting different colors to make almost like a rainbow effect. Noticing how that part of your body feels with that rainbow. Just being aware of how you feel. And now, you can 
and just allow that color to go back to how it was before and you can remove the outline of the magic marker Going back to the what we did at the beginning to gauge what level you were between one and ten, and now noticing how it's changed. And if you choose, you can redo this in your mind as many times as you want, as many times as you choose. You can listen every day until you get to the point where you are so relaxed so peaceful so peaceful and calm and you can notice how the whole of your body now feels relaxed including your mind. And that brings us to the end of this recording. And I'll speak to you again tomorrow. Thank you for listening and remember to be kind to yourself because you deserve to be happy. Lots of love. Bye.